गुड मॉर्निंग सो दिस इज डॉक्टर राजकुमार आर्या एसोसिएट प्रोफेसर इन डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ एम के एन आई टी जलंधर टूडे विल ड्राइव द एक्सप्रेशन फॉर हीट ट्रांसफर इन सिलेंडर सो दिस इज एक्चुअली यू कैन से सी ए सिलेंडर ऑफ रेडियस आर so we want to generate expression for temperature variation within this cylinder where energy is also being generated so we have taken a differential cylinder of some differential length uh, but that first we are talking about heat transfer only in radial direction only so in radial side we have taken a segment r and this we have increased by r plus delta r so in this case uh, rate of energy in at r minus rate of energy out at r plus delta r plus energy is generated within the material would be equal to accumulation pass so area is 2 pi r l at any r so rate of heat conduction at r minus rate of heat conduction at r plus delta r equal to rate of heat generation inside the material equal to rate of change of energy contained of the element or material so in that case substitute that so you have q dot r minus q dot r plus delta r plus e dot generation into of the element plus delta e of element upon delta t time so delta e of the element is given by mc the t at t plus delta t minus t at time t equal to rho c a delta r and here you have uh, t t plus delta t minus t so this area is always perpendicular to the direction of flow and multiply by thickness can give you all the time with the volume actually so energy generated within the material would be energy generation rate per unit volume multiplied by volume a delta r substitute everything there so we are getting q dot r minus q dot r plus delta r e dot generation into a delta r rho c a delta r t t plus delta t minus t at time t divided by delta t area is 2 pi r l so you may take area of 2 pi r plus delta r by 2 so at last you are substituting r equal to 0 so this will only complicate it actually so you can take area is 2 pi r 2 pi r l only dividing energy equation by a delta r so we will get this now substituting the limit r tends to 0 delta t tends to 0 so you will get 1 upon a del upon del r k a del t upon del r plus e dot generation equal to rho c del t upon del t now for years law we can use for years law there so you have q dot r this q that minus k a del t upon del r so you can put area equal to 2 pi r l so you can substitute here and at last we'll get 1 upon r del upon del r k r del t upon del r plus e dot generation equal to rho c del t upon del t for variable conductivity for constant conductivity take the k common from here or then divide the entire equation by k so you will get here a term k by rho c p which is known as thermal diffusivity then for steady states this side is zero so you will have to get this one transient with no heat generation so this particular term e dot generation would vanish so yes, you will have one upon r d upon dr r dt upon dr equal to one upon alpha del t upon del t so 
for steady state no heat generation so your governing equation all the time is d upon dr r dt upon dr equal to zero so this need two boundary conditions to solve it so these are the references heat and mass transfer fundamental application next is heat and mass transfer practical approach so thank you very much you are most welcome for your comments and suggestions